So what we're going to do now is we're going to measure out 12 cc's of water. So I've got the 12 right here and I've got it set. We'll take this, open it, and we're going to twist this slightly and then push the water down. That gives us 12 cc's of water. We add our 50 cc's of, of stone and now we're going to mix it together it should get to a fairly stiff yet creamy consistency now we're going to put this over the top this is a Whitmix vacuum mixer we put this in and it's going to create vacuum Put it right into place, and then we turn this switch to the on position so we take it off, it'll still continue to suck. Notice that we've got suction up here that's sucking the bubbles out of the stone while it's being mixed. Okay, we'll mix it for 10, 15, 20 seconds. For dye stone, that works out pretty well. The longer you mix it, the more it breaks up little crystals that are beginning to form, and it'll make it set faster. Okay. Now we're going to vibrate, remove our, our suction, now you can see we have no bubbles in here, it's a nice, dense, smooth, creamy mix. We're going to take our impression, we'll start by spraying some debubbleizer on it. Flick off the excess. Now we're going to take just a little bit here. And we want to slowly flow the stone into the impression. So it goes really, really slow and doesn't trap any bubbles. Then we let it just kind of work its way over. We're adding just a little bit at a time. Notice that it moves fast if I if I hold it, but notice how I'm holding this right here, it's creating a surface tension that slows down how much, how fast the stone goes. Notice over here it's slowly filling in. When we drop it and it goes, then there's no more surface tension and it flows faster. Or we can go really slow and just let it hold off the spatula. Is there one way preferable over the other? Uh, you look at how fast it's flowing the stone down through the teeth. Um, if it's not trapping any air bubbles, then it doesn't matter. Now you'll notice that I'm filling it the rest of the way with our green stone. It's getting just a little bit of vibration because my fingers are still setting on it. And it's still it's starting to drip out the bottom. And it is. That's the excess stuff. Then, we're going to put this right here like this. that has the pins in it. Next we'll take this and we'll put it right over the top. And let it just set. And how long does it sit? We're going to let that set about 45 minutes. 